Belfast, a capital city, dynamic, vibrant, creative. The city that built the Titanic. The city that produced Game of Thrones. And now, the city of the glider. Transforming public transport in Belfast. Gliding with better, faster connections across the city. Gliding for business and tourism. And gliding to improve the environment with an eco-hybrid system, powered by Cummins. The Glider is a £90 million investment in public transport in Belfast. It's a bus rapid transit system connecting east and west of Belfast along a 26 km route. And what it's really done for Belfast is made it much easier for people to use public transport. Uh, in the first six months of launch, it's taken on 40,000 new passengers using public transport, which is about a 25% increase in public transport usage along that route. We took a whole system approach to introducing bus rapid transit. So we put in new ticketing, we put in new halts, uh, we put in uh, new bus lanes with uh, bus prioritisation right across the network. And that's really enhanced the punctuality and reliability of the service. And we've seen a big reduction in car usage along the route and uh, with a, a, a proportionate increase in the number of people using public transport. People now feel that it's easier to get around Belfast on the glider and therefore they'll come into Belfast maybe using the train or using the coach service from other cities and towns and made really public transport across Northern Ireland uh, um, increase generally. The vehicles are uh, 18 metre articulated, powered by hybrid diesel electric engines. So we have air conditioning, uh, we've got USB charging points, Wi-Fi. But the diesel hybrid technology means that they're ultra low emission vehicles uh, and it means for us that's helping us to improve our air quality. As well as that, in the first six months the engines have proved to be very reliable. A lot of our passengers comment on how quiet the vehicles are. Uh, and again, that's something that we're looking for in all new technology going forward. At the bus stop, engine idling is almost eliminated, improving the passenger experience as they board or alight the glider. The Cummins Euro 6 engine is fully integrated within the Van Hool Eco Hybrid system, generating the energy to charge the glider's electric battery pack. This enables the glider to operate with zero emissions for around 15 minutes every hour, with a seamless transition between engine off and engine on modes. The glider is up to 33% more fuel efficient than the buses they've replaced, lowering CO2 emissions by around 2.5 tonnes per vehicle in each month of operation. With the gliders operating up to 16 hours every day, the TransLink Service Centre keeps the fleet up and running in first-class condition with Cummins Ireland ready to support when needed. Gliders have been very reliable. Uh, we've rarely been needed by TransLink here at the Mile Water Depot. Well, when we do come here, we use our diagnostic tooling to uh, open up a window into the engine. Uh, that can show us the engine's fault history, uh, features and parameters, or any duty cycle changes we need to see. Well, our diagnostic software, Insight, uh, allows us to capture an image from the ECM. Well, when I take a download from this engine, I'll then analyse it and we can compare it to other downloads we've taken from engines across the fleet. What we're seeing is some very high levels of uptime. The feedback from our passengers has been excellent. And in fact, all our stakeholders, um, so our, you know, the authority, the Department of Infrastructure, the local council, um, businesses, have all welcomed the introduction of Glider to Belfast. Uh, so much so that we're already planning phase two of Glider, which will run north to south in the city and connect up our universities as well. Um, so from that perspective, it's a big opportunity to grow public transport in Belfast uh, and to enhance the connection for people, for businesses and for the economy overall. In terms of roadside emissions, the Cummins system eliminates 99% of all particulate matter and also achieves NOx levels lower than the stringent Euro 6 standard, even lower than a single diesel car. Music